In Niger State, the National Hydropower Producing Areas Development Commission has convened a meeting of commissioners of agriculture from its 10 member states for a workshop in MENA. And this is aimed at fostering a significant move towards sustainable agriculture and rural development. Nabi Bamae has details. These commissioners are from the 10 states in Nigeria where hydro dams that generate electricity for Nigeria are located or areas affected by the dams. Residents of these areas are majorly farmers who are confronted with dire ecological challenges, especially floods that often sweep away their farmlands. This workshop convened by N Hyperdeck is a proactive approach towards redefining agricultural practices and introducing sustainable agriculture to farmers in these areas. That uh, the major landmark in Nigeria, uh, potential agriculturally viable land in Nigeria, 40 to 60, 50 percent of it falls within the hyperdeck states, and uh, we want to seize that opportunity to ensure that we don't we not just produce food for food sake, but we produce food as an economic activity. The resource persons at the workshop are lecturers from two Nigerian universities. They recommend the usage of light mechanized farming equipment to avoid destruction of soil properties and encourage vegetable farming to help farmers make quick money after a flood experience. It's very serious. Nobody wants to work like his grandfather worked, like I said. And for you to have small machineries getting there that is of low cost as assistance from either government or as loan will indeed benefit the youth. Advocating for horticultural crops. These are species of crops that within a, a short life cycle, you can produce them several times. Commissioners representing two member states expressed enthusiasm about the potential impact of the workshop. And um, Hapadek is uh, really going to be uh, the game changer in Taraba State because of their interests. As we have them before now, the interaction is having uh, every state model bring to the table then the peculiarity of every state on how to sustain food production in our state. Smallholder farmers collectively contribute a significant portion to the world's food supply, and this set of farmers are usually affected by the impact of climate change. The drive of this workshop is to see how Hyperdeck can collaborate with various state governments in order for sustainable agriculture to be practiced and encouraged in the states. Chenemibame, TVC News, Mina.